Cynthia Denton, my husband Larry, and we've been at the big seminar and the site that we have and the business we're running is menopauseresourceguide.com. We've been to the system seminar this week. It has been marvelous. During this seminar, I have created several joint ventures and most importantly, I have enjoyed having so many women here at the conference. We have talked about what our needs are and we've made plans of how we're going to help each other expand our businesses. And so it has been very, very good and I just, I can't thank Armand enough for creating this platform so that women can enter the enter this business and start to understand how to market and we all have a, a way that we can help each other. And so we're really looking forward to the next uh, big seminar and all of the progress that we're going to make in between. I'll just, tell that, I'll just tell that story again. It's all about the elevator. Oh, yeah, that's good. No, but uh, I think if we uh, just implement the things that we've learned, uh, we're going to see a large difference. I actually thought we were done networking for the day. I came down on the elevator and I, and I ran into a guy and he says, "Oh, he says hi." He says, uh, "My name's Sean." He says, "We haven't met." So I said, "We took hands, whatever." And he says, uh, "Have you got a card?" And I went, ah, "No, I think I'm all." I said, "I don't have any in my pocket." And he says, uh, "He says, well, that's okay." so they can get you from the website. provide a customized program for you specifically. So the idea for big business and fundraising groups, the customer for us is that... Yeah, sure. <laughs> Keep going! <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, with this this uh, audio seminar stuff, uh, you can take that literally upload it to your website and then sell the product and have a product to sell. In, in the package, Armand's already given you all the sales letters, all the autoresponder messages, and if you go to the website and sign up for the affiliate link, anything that's sold through those links is yours. Really? What's the percentage? It's entirely up to you. Holy cow. That's well, awesome, right? Actually, you get like 35% the first shot, then 10% on the second layer. So it's, like it's a two-tier affiliate program. That's but awesome. But the suggested retail is like 90 seven bucks so go out there and try to sell it and then it'll automatically pre-sell the next seminar for you sounds good oh, yeah. Yeah. thanks mate that was You're awesome <laughs> As you know, this conference has just been so exciting. Tell me, what was the most exciting thing for you? Most exciting for me? It's hard to decide which one was which item was the most exciting. Well, you, too many. Well, you know, the, I, I go ahead. The the uh, the freeze the uh, the first page where you capture your name before you go to the sales letter. That yes. was one of the items. Yeah, I mean that that is a technique that I'm going to mm -hmm. be implementing as soon as I get back on my on my one website. Not working on multiple, but on that one website. But you know, the biggest surprise for me, you know, here we here we were. We're filling out the evaluation, what we like about the conference, and then we had the wrap up. But the wrap-up was the most enthralling experience I could ever imagine because we were we were just drawn in to the real life questions that people were experiencing and the real life answers and you know what the answers were different I mean there were there was debate and fruitful discussion different people had, had different opinions about exactly. what worked exactly yeah. exactly and that, that was the one thing if I if I could go back and rewrite that evaluation I'd say throw out all the rest and have the wrap-up at the end because that wrap-up panel discussion was golden. It was I would fantastic. want more of that, actually. Uh -huh. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You didn't want it to stop, right? That's right. Yeah, that's great. Good stuff. Well, hey, it was great getting to talk with you. Okay, nice All right. talking to you. Let's see you later. Out to me, and he says, because he, he knew about my success with the watches, and he goes, Ken, did you know that if any one item in your house, you have more clothes hangers than even silverware usually? We do, yeah. And I thought about it, and I said, that's right, you know, they do. And then he says, um, did you know that, like, Macy's, last year alone, bought, like, over $2 million or something in clothes hangers? I, I suppose they have to and, get them somewhere. And I said, yeah, I guess that. That's, that's right, you know, and he says, all right, now name one major brand of clothes hangers. Is there one? No, I couldn't think of it either. Yeah, yeah. And he says, but now any other product you can almost think of, some brand will yep. pop in your yeah. mind. Yep. And he says, I want to be the hanger king. 
right now that gets about 2,000 people a day right now. And um, I quote about two to 3,000 people a day. And I don't know very much about search engines, but I'm prepared to trade some media um, information to anybody that can help me out with search engine information. Uh, do you guys do search engine information? Do you know meta tags? Do you know how meta tags work with? Um, <laughs> do you know how meta tags work on the front page with the search engines? Do you put the same front page wordings as you do have, yeah, you have with meta tags? No. 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 It's too hard because it changes all the time. It's a full time job learning those tactics and applying them. Well, well my web designer. Tell you what, I mean, my MLM site. Yeah. I hired somebody to do it, and it's remained in the top five uh, searches on Yahoo. Oh, really? That, but that's also probably because of the popularity, but I, I have no idea yeah. how they did it. You may want to hire someone, someone to do it yeah. for you. Yeah. You don't want to learn it yourself, because no, no, it's but, a full-time job. It's constantly changing. But my programmer says, you know... Pardon? Sumatra Roy. Yeah? He does that. He does? I forget his website now. Okay. So does Dave Kelly at Arundel.net? Because I went from a frame site to some other site that my programmer said that, would, that doesn't have frames. And all of a sudden, my search engines like dropped, and then I'm slowly coming back up. But it is, you know, who is to know that kind of information? So you had a greenhouse. Yeah, we had a second and third story greenhouse with a like a a. a um, me Mexican tile floor uh -huh. and about 90 tons of rocks under it and the, the sun would heat up the greenhouse and would blow it from the top of the house under the house through these tubes and the, and the rock beds and then would just like be radiant heat right through the floor. Really? Yeah, it was, it was very cool. Yeah. Yeah. And it, um, it worked good until like the storms, that, you know, rain for three or four days where it's cold then then it would kind of cool off. But wow. I think trip. this house, actually, what? you could use the power. Really? Regardless, yeah. They, they totally had everything solar power. So oh, nice. They used no electricity, no... No electricity no at all, No electricity huh? at all, yeah. That would be wonderful to, like, disconnect from the grid and then you wouldn't have to worry about the blackout. That's, that's what they were talking about. How yeah. They were trying to encourage. What was he talking about there? The, um, um, he was the, with the parrots. He was talking about um, the, the headlines. He put the headlines up there and, and just really ramped it out to the 50 different sites. Um, and he went step by step down through how to select the, the Google AdWords keywords um, and look for traffic uh, or look for monthly searches anywhere from 30,000 to 70,000 hits. Okay. Uh, and, and that's so how he selected the topic. Of yes, he, he okay. had to have a certain level of traffic every month before he really focused in on that niche, but going from start to finish, all right, you, you do some keywords and you do your ask campaign and you spend, what, $30, $40 to get some good feedback from there. Uh, you pay somebody on Elance, like 500 bucks to create your ebook. Yeah. Put up your website, what, like 10 bucks a month to put up a website? Yeah. Uh, he was using some of the shopping cart software. Like, I, I think he said he was using ClickBank it's for like a one page. Right, a one page sales letter. Use the Ask Campaign uh, questions as his headlines. Um, and uh, it, it was just. You know, a really cool concept. So we're, so we're like actually simplified a lot of it. I mean, it's like you know, and it's relatively easy, kind of. You know, they put like an easy spin on it. It's like, hey, it's like yeah. Right there. Well, yes and no, but it really is easy. It's not that hard. Like a lazy bastard way of doing things. <laughs> well, that's it. And I wrote down lazybastard.com, and yeah. he's, he's not going to be able to put that on there now. But <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> but yeah, I wrote it down. I'm like, hmm, I wonder who has that registered. Um, but we're going to be doing some similar type things with with our service. So uh, we're going to be doing. Uh, uh, he has another site where he has uh, videos about how to do all of these certain things. He was said something about videos uh, about using Google AdWords um, on a CD. So, you know, of course, in the autoresponder business, we're going to do some videos about how to use autoresponders and how to use our service. So it's like, all right, pay to learn how to use our service. So we're going to do some things like that and have some Camtasia videos up. I was talking to uh, Mike Camtasia, Stewart. Camtasia, is that the uh, That's the, the screenshot and, and audio. Yeah, Sweet. exactly. Okay. Okay. Uh, so I was talking to Mike Stewart, and we got, I don't know, you probably saw his little hand. Were you in here for his presentation? Yeah.
So you're going to change the postcard, yep. and you're going to have three call to actions, the autoresponder, the 800 number with the 24-hour recorded message, and then the website, the website. without the dashes. the dashes. Right, take okay. the dashes out, change it to uh, does your website talk yet, mm -hmm. add the S like we talked about, and put the free report on the top, and restructure it. And then tomorrow's appointment, what's going to happen? Because I really like that you're taking action the morning out. Right? I am, and I had set up that meeting, obviously, because I'm in, in town and, and took the extra day. I thought I'd have to decompress a little bit as well. I've got a lot to do tonight. But I'm going to specifically be meeting with these two to, to tell them, look, I've got a way to tap into your market, mm -hmm. solve some of your customer pro service problems, and lay this, this plan out. If I've they, already, if they take I already it, own the name. Yeah. See, their, their name of their software is Genesis 2000. It's the, the number two software in the country mm -hmm. for mortgage lending. And they also own another one, which I should probably reserve too. But I own AskGenesis2000.com. And they have a new software coming out. I own that one too. So <laughs> they sort of don't have a choice if they want to do something like that. And I'm not going to let them. I'll run the whole thing. So you're going to do like one hour tele seminar. Just dial in. It's every Tuesday two o'clock. Two o'clock in. Yeah, in two o'clock is uh, time. Eastern. Okay. Yes. And just just listen to him because what he's doing at this time is just like one hour. It's every Tuesday, and you could actually every Tuesday you could follow at the same time. He's talking about the same thing and it's business plan. Okay. Guerrilla marketing point of view. I love guerrilla marketing. Okay, and he gives really new. Actually, I, I have like I finished guerrilla marketing coaches. I mean, I have certification. I know the seven-step plan like the way J. Levinson teaches. This is complete. I mean, the same seven, but different point of view. I think you really ben will benefit from it. I you would. Could, you could like yeah. just grab it and use it. I, uh, anything that's new, anything that's different, that'll help you know the people that I do this for. Yeah, I understand. You know, that, that's I'm, why I'm all for it. Yeah, that's, I, that, that's why I'm telling you that you really need to do this. I, I can email it to you by the end of the week. Yep, that'll be fine. Not, I, I doubt that it's going to be and tomorrow anyway. Yep, and you got yep. my personal yeah. email anyway, yeah. so. Yeah, yeah, so. Don't. Try not to give that out to everybody, okay, please. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, I got to, you know, okay. my spam block is no, no, working no, no, overtime no, no. already. No, so. I, I can do it. Normally, even even like, for example, like Perry Marshall, the, he, he does Google AdWords. Uh, even yeah. before, before give, giving his name, when people ask me, I always contact him first. Right. Take, yeah. Like, you know, come on, it's personal information. You know, if you trust me enough to give it to me, this is Sean at WWIFM. I'm kidding. <laughs> What's in it for me? Did you get it? Got it. <laughs> um, I'd just like to say, hey, I think Ralph is a heck of a nice guy. And that's John Reese behind him right there. Yes, ladies and gentlemen. Ralph, I want to thank you. Like uh, Ryan said, you're a great spirited man. I appreciate it. Thank you for taking all the pictures. Thank you for making this a wonderful event. And uh, over to Ryan. Uh, all I can say is ditto on that. I haven't had a real opportunity to meet, to meet you personally, Ralph, but just seeing you uh, flow through the events uh, effortlessly, seamlessly, um, meeting new people and just uh, just being there, c uh, capturing everything uh, is a, a very, very, uh, a very gracious thing to do. And I, I look forward to to meeting you on a, a fr friendly level. Thanks. So then I told Armin to stop it because if he's going to do that to me, <laughs> no posing. Hi, no. And you still decide to work with Armin? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Just keep on talking, we're taking...
know, I, I was walking the cold there. Uh, I, 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 I retired at one point at just about time, January 2000. Uh, All right, on January 6th. Yeah. Uh, I did, yeah. Rob, nice to meet you. Yeah, I can just be, I'll just be down here at that time. I'll probably be down here at that time. I'm here till Tuesday. My plan is on Tuesday. I wanted an extra day uh, because I wanted to find out people that were going to come to the country. I just sit around all weekend and try another day. I wanted to go with the uh, one child in the park, so we did that. But then I noticed the park can't do that. You know, when you've done this, Mama, I think that's the best thing to do. And a judgment, you know, you're like, oh my gosh, something that I actually said to him, you know, he's coming back at the toy. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to be sure saying it, throwing it all the time. Yeah, but you know what, it was good, and I'm a dancer. So what I did with my son going through uh, teenage years, it's like I always said we created a space to dance in. And it was never like, I knew what he wanted to hear. And I was like, well, you know, I look through it with my adult eyes and we may look at the same thing, but we have a different interpretation. And I see something different because I have my eyes, my adult eyes, you have your teenage eyes. What are we seeing? Well, I'm going to kill you. <laughs>